United Sex, a group of Catholic nuns are trying to raise awareness when it comes to social justice issues. So they brought their multi-state tour right through Buffalo today. And as 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ed Riley shows us now, these women of faith are also inspiring our local nuns. Our times demand us to stand up for the people. Nuns on the bus is part of a social justice lobby inspired by Catholic sisters under the name Network. 20 nuns are now traveling to 13 states and both the Republican and Democratic National Convention to spread a message that in today's divisive world, there needs to be greater inclusion of all groups of people. Awareness that race cannot divide us. Race needs to bring us together. The nuns hit the road to answer a call from Pope Francis saying healthy politics is sorely needed. And during this presidential election year, the sisters are visiting cities to gather information about income gaps, lack of health care, citizenship, and housing problems. Hearing from every community about what's happening, what are the gaps and what's breaking us apart, what's bringing us together. Nuns on the bus stopped at St. Paul's Episcopal Cathedral and was joined by Congressman Brian Higgins. They were also greeted by an enthusiastic contingent of local Catholic nuns. I am so excited. I am so happy they were able to stop here. For these nuns, the effort is an inspiration. They represent all of us women religious around the U.S., and they're standing up for some very important issues that our country needs at this time. But the reality is the number of nuns is shrinking, and very few women are taking up the vocation. Well, it may be a different church in the future. What I've seen is a lot of wonderful, wonderful lay people are doing a lot of the work that that nuns have done in the past. I do think young people do care. Maybe our nuns have, the numbers have gone down, but I think religious life and spiritual life will continue. But for today, it was a chance to be proud, sign the bus, and send it on its way, knowing that nuns are still a strong voice to be reckoned Yay! with. Thank you, <laughs> Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News. And 7